Hey guys, White here from DripApps.com, and just as promised, we're gonna stick to the theme of e-com, Shopify, and SEO. Today we're gonna be talking about viral traffic, viral content, and all kinds of marketing that you can use to just bring in tons of organic traffic to your store. So right now I have an example Shopify store pulled up for Boston Terriers. Uh, I just quickly want to show you what an example shop looks like. This one only has uh, five or six products, but usually you'll have a lot more products. And what's great about these physical e-com stores is that when people are browsing, they just buy. You don't need to sell them. You don't need to create a long sales video or um, you know a long post convincing them to buy or warming up the traffic. They literally, if you can get them to your site, whether it's from a blog post or you know a Pinterest image, it doesn't matter. Once they're here, they're gonna start browsing around. And as long as you've gotten the right people to your site, for example, someone who's passionate about Boston Terriers, then there's a good chance that something on here will appeal to them and they'll end up checking out and purchasing something. So our whole goal is just to get people to this store who are interested in Boston Terriers. And turns out that's actually pretty easy to do. And one of the most effective strategies um, to do that is viral content. Now, we don't wanna reinvent the wheel and try to come up with content that just goes viral on its own. No, 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 no. That work is already done. We just have to go copy um, some viral posts, essentially, and rework them and, uh, and then just put them on our own blog. It's actually really, really simple. So there are two tools um, that work extremely well for finding viral content in your niche. And this works for Shopify stores the best because, again, we're just trying to get traffic to our store that's interested in this topic and then they'll end up purchasing one of these physical products but you can do this for other things as well such as affiliate seo sites or uh, just any informational sites on the internet so the two uh the two tools that we're going to be using first of all the ahrefs content explorer by the way you don't have to use both of these tools one or you know the other will work so if you already have an ahrefs subscription you can easily use their content explorer and the other one is BuzzSumo, which you also need a subscription for, but it's a little bit cheaper. Obviously, it doesn't do as much as Ahrefs uh, does. But for this specific um, thing that we're going to be doing, which is you know content exploring, then it, it definitely it definitely works. So, um, starting out with Ahrefs, we're going to look at the topic of survival. So let's imagine we had a Shopify store all about um, survival, um, camping, all kinds of physical products like that. Right? We might have tents, we might have knives, we might have um, cooking pans, I don't know, whatever people in, in the survival niche like. You know, I would have to do my research there, but we could fill up our store all about survival. And that's a very targeted store. We know exactly you know, what kind of people are gonna be coming to that store and we can sell them those products. So all we're gonna do is come to one of these content explorers and search something like survival. Actually, I'm gonna search camping. And now it's just gonna bring back the top shared posts in this niche with this keyword. So right here, I already see it just a great post. This got 8.7 thousand shares on Twitter and 2 million shares, that's crazy, on Facebook. It doesn't matter if they've already been shared a ton. It, this is proven right these posts are proven so if you put it out you rework it a little bit and then put it out on your own blog it's already proven to go viral so people are going to share it guaranteed so you can come in here and look at these posts like right here we have 41 camping hacks and we can literally just copy this of course we want to change it a little bit you can hire someone off of you know upwork or um you know a freelancing site to come here here and rework this rewrite it get you some different pictures in here um, but essentially, these are proven posts, right? So let's go back. 10 classic camping meals. So why is this good? Well, we have these posts that are proven um, to go viral. This is perfect right here, this post. 10 classic camping meals. So we can rework this comp or content, have someone rewrite it, put it on our own Shopify blog, which is extremely easy to do. Um, you're just going to go to online store and blog post, and you can come in here and add a blog post. Super easy. So let's imagine we do this, right? 
it's proven to go viral. So if we share this on Facebook, if we start running just a few ads to it, um, you know, we're targeting people in the survival space or people who like camping, and it's gonna get like one cent clicks, which is why it's so great, right? It's, it's a viral, uh, it's already proven. People are proven to click on it. So they're gonna be coming to our blog via one cent clicks on Facebook. And once it, people start sharing it, it's gonna start getting links, uh, start getting backlinks. Your site's gonna build authority. It's gonna get a bunch of social shares. And you start to rank for keywords that you don't even know uh, you're ranking for. Literally, you could rank for keywords like camping meals, which could be a very big keyword. Uh, let's go ahead and actually search that. And you can actually build, you know, you can build links yourselves too, such as PBM links and whatnot. But what's so great is that you're getting just a great start. You're getting traffic to your site. Uh, you're getting um, social shares. Not sure what's up with that. You're getting social shares. Um, you're getting links to your site. And so it's just a great jump start for SEO. So we're just going to search camping meals here. And we can see that camping meals gets almost 10,000 searches per month. That's insane. If we're ranking for that keyword, we're going to be getting a ton of traffic to our survival site. That's from one blog post, one blog post. I hope you guys see the potential in this. Now, what's so great is that not only can you rank for that main keyword like camping meals, you could rank for each individual meal if they're popular, like, you know, camping, how to cook hot dogs camping, for example, could be a great keyword. Like, let's come in here and search for this. How to cook hot dogs camping. Let's see. Let's go um, camping hot dogs. Anyways, there are so many long tail keywords that you could be ranking for and you don't even have to try. Since you're getting all these social links and uh, since your post is going viral, it's gonna be getting linked to. And because of that, uh, you're gonna end up ranking for all these long tail keywords literally from one blog post and start to get organic traffic. And that's why it's so powerful. You'll get shares on Pinterest, shares on Facebook, and all this time, people are gonna be coming back to your Shopify store who are interested in camping and survival, and there's a good chance that they'll end up buying one of your physical products. It's extremely powerful. So same thing on uh, BuzzSumo, we can come in here and search like survival, and it's gonna return some posts. I'm not logged in right now, but we could do like a zombie survival one. That's not exactly the niche that we're in. Um, list of important documents, that could be a good one emergency preparedness that's exactly what this niche is into um, since it is an older crowd that's into survival uh, and emergency preparedness is pretty much exactly in that same niche so we could take a look at this post for example and you know rework it have someone rewrite it and just like that we have a viral post on our blog on our shopify store now here's where the second part of this comes in and this is why it's so amazing and uh, so powerful so we can come in here, I'm not logged in, but you can view backlinks for this article, and we can also do that on Ahrefs. We can come in here and uh, grab this domain name, and we can come back and put that on Ahrefs. I'm not sure if this post will have any backlinks, but we can check. Yeah, it does. So it looks like we have 19 referring domains. So this is awesome, right? We can come in here and look at these backlinks. Like let's imagine we, we made a better post. Instead of 10 classic camping meals, we made 15 amazing camping meals, right? And we can come in here and now we can reach out to all these sites and we can see where that link, let's, let's look at the, uh, the backlinks actually. One sec. So we can come in here and look at these backlinks. We have a better post now than what these sites are already linking to. So we can come in here and say, <clears throat> you know, we actually, we can reach out to them and say, hey, I saw you were linking to, you know, the top 10 classic camping meals. Uh, my site actually just made a new post about 15 camping meals. I think it's updated and your readers would really enjoy it. You gotta come up with some kind of 
message that you can send them, but essentially you can hijack that link and ask the owner of the site to also link to you. You already know they're in, you know they already know they're talking about the same content. You already know that they linked to this other site, so the chances that they're going to link to you as well is really high. And so we can hijack their links and start to get these same backlinks. So let's look at another one. This is on the LifeProof blog, which is you know LifeProof is obviously a huge brand. So somewhere on this page, they're linking to camping recipes right there. Here's the link. We can reach out to LifeProof and say, hey, I saw you were linking to camping recipes. We actually have twice as many, and it's a little bit updated. Uh, would you mind checking this out, maybe linking to it for your readers, um, or linking to it for your readers to see, or whatever, something like that. Come up with a creative post, and if you help them out, that's even better in some way. Point out some flaw on their site, or some broken link, or something like that, and we can hijack these links and start to get backlinks to our blog posts that are viral. They're proven to go viral. So as soon as traffic starts going, people are going to share it on Pinterest, uh, Facebook, Twitter, et cetera. And all this time, we're getting a ton of organic traffic to our store, again, where they're gonna end up buying these physical products. So hopefully you guys see the power in this. I mean, I barely tap the surface. You can do this in absolutely any niche, and uh, it, it just works, right? And there's so many viral posts, you're never gonna run out of content that you can rework and continuously post onto your site. You can literally hire someone for $5 an hour to do this for you, and it's just so powerful. But one of the keys too is start running traffic on Facebook yourself. Start getting those one cent clicks to your blog post. Um, first of all, you know, you're probably gonna profit off that traffic anyways, because they're gonna go to your blog, or I mean your Shopify store and start purchasing those products. Even if they don't though, they are gonna start sharing it and so you're gonna start getting free organic traffic and eventually start ranking for all of these long tail keywords in Google. Obviously, it's no secret that there's a huge opportunity with Shopify and Ecom right now and I really want you guys to take advantage of it. So if you're interested in learning the step-by-step -step process of setting up a store, finding products, sourcing them, and you know just tons more traffic methods like we talked about today. Literally everything from A to Z, from starting from scratch to being able to sell physical products on Shopify, then you are in luck. The number one Shopify course is launching in just a few days, and the Drip Apps team really got behind this one with a huge bonus package and we're calling it the Ecom Masters Package. Just click the link below this video to learn more about it. I just recorded a video explaining what EPA is and what our bonus package is and why this is such a huge opportunity. So just go ahead and click the link in the description below.